Hello, I'm Steve Dixon. I'm Professor of Contemporary Crafts at Manchester Metropolitan University. This is my workshop in my garden in Didsbury in South Manchester. I've recently had my studio rebuilt, so I'd like to show you around the studio and show you some of the things I make here. This is the inside of the studio. As it's quite new, I haven't quite filled it up yet. These are commercial bathroom tiles and I've decorated them with my screen printed ceramic transfers. I make a lot of figuratively decorated plates and also large ceramic sculptures. This is a new piece. It's a portrait of the Greek goddess Persephone. And this is a finished piece. It's the Chinese dissident Lu Chao Bo. As well as printed plates, I also make large printed vessels. This is a large oil can vessel. It's inspired by my collection of tin oil cans. You can see on the shelves here. At the end of my studio is the kiln area. I have a trusty old electric kiln and also a brand new gas kiln. Inside the electric kiln there's a large white glazed plate which I'm going to be decorating later in the video. These are majolica plates printed with ceramic transfers. These plates were commissioned from a workshop in Faenza in Italy and decorated by myself here in the studio in Manchester. I'd like to show you how I make my large plates now. I make my plates from slabs of clay, they're slab built on a plaster mould and I build them almost like I'm building um, a freestanding vessel. This is the artwork I'm going to print from. It's a series of drawings of the coronavirus and I'm going to photocopy these using a laser printer onto a special ceramic transfer paper.
print is then put face to face with another paper. Uh, this is a laminating paper um, that applies a cover coat to the surface of the print. Those two papers go face to face. They go into a heat proof pouch. And then through a laminating machine. Once it's been through the heated rollers, these two sheets of paper are fused together. We can take it out of the pouch and peel them apart. And the print has now got a plastic cover coat layer over the top. It's ready to be applied to the ceramic. To apply the transfer prints to the ceramic surface, they're first cut out. and then put into water for about one minute. After soaking in water, the print will separate from the backing paper. And this allows you to slide it onto the ceramic surface. And then it's rubbed down very carefully to get out any moisture, any water, and any air bubbles. I'm now going to add some of the coronavirus transfers that we printed earlier. The narrative here is our culture under threat from the coronavirus. This is a factory made plate, uh, bought in a local charity shop and I'm adding uh, a print of the statue of Edward Colston um, who was a slave trader and his statue was recently torn down as part of the Black Lives Matter protests. I'd like to invite the potters of Gundiali to take part in a project with me to make or decorate your own plates, old plates or new plates, working on your own or working together, and to send me pictures of these and tell me your stories, and I'll make some plates of my own based on these. Thank you.